The sneakiest of needs for the Denver Broncos is at the safety position, though if they don't keep Justin Simmons, it's no longer sneaky. Will Parks is a free agent, Kareem Jackson has one year left on his deal, and the depth is non-existent. They need to look to better their depth with starting potential, and Tyree Gillespie out of Missouri really fits the bill. In college, he did a lot of work as a single high safety and has good range, but his best work came as a split double high safety. He is a smart safety that doesn't get caught out of position or biting on any kind of fakes during the play. The issues that he has with his play come when he's coming up against the run, and while he has the attitude to be great, he just needs to be more consistent with his technique. Another versatile safety is Andre Sisco, who did a lot of single high and two high stuff during his time at Syracuse. He is another inconsistent tackler, much like Kareem Jackson is, and at times he'll play it safe with his tackling and go for the ankle or drag down attempts. His ball skills, range, and athleticism are all elite traits and really give him the versatility to play multiple schemes and roles in the NFL. While he has the willingness to be a run defender, his tackling is an issue, and that leaves the only role that he can't really do is being a box safety, which with his athleticism and range, you don't want from him anyways. Then there is TCU's Trevin Mulrig, who is widely viewed as a top safety in the draft class because of his range and athleticism. He is another one of these that has done a lot of single high stuff, but can also work as a double high safety in the NFL. There is elite range from Mulrig, and he really does project as the best center fielding safety since Earl Thomas came out. That is what he is best at and what you would ideally have him as, but he has the role and scheme versatility to be of a value to anyone. Denver's decision on Justin Simmons is going to have an obviously huge impact on how badly they need help at the safety position. It sounds like both sides want to get a deal done, so it wouldn't be surprising to see Denver tag him and then go from there while looking to draft for depth and Jackson's replacement. For Mile High Huddle, I'm Eric Trickle.